try something new. I don't have a picture for this, for what I'm doing. But you can watch that as I as I do it. You drop out of hyperspace exactly as you intended, and exactly where you intended, in front of your target. The starship RMS Alien. Your police officers. You've been tasked with figuring out what happened to this ship when it disappeared exactly three days ago. <laughs> You've been sent on this mission to find out what happened to the RMS alien. It disappeared three days ago. Sorry, I had it very perfectly in my head while I was getting the computer set up. And of course by the time I got the computer set up, the idea was much farther along and then I forgot it. <clears throat> Sorry, where was I? <sighs> You've arrived where you intended. Yeah, you heard me. Now we're here. Okay, um, you can scan the ship to find out more about it. Good. Um, there's no need to roll for this. The system, you know how to use it, and can use it quite well. The, uh, the ship is disabled, drifting. Um, it has running lights, although they're flickering in the aft section. Uh, this is exactly where the back of the ship appears to have been broken. Um, it's, it's been cracked and is definitely out of joint. Um, it's obvious signs of damage. Um, there are pieces blasted out of the ship. It's torn, very similar to the Titanic as it went down. There are some sections in the uh, lower parts of the ship, lowest parts of the ship, however, that are still um, connected and pressurized. Um, what else do you see on the scanner? Um, there are parts of the ship that are pressurized. There are sporadic life signs. Mm. The damage is, is fatal. The, the ship is dying. Um, its batteries have got to soon be drained. Um, it's been three days uh, without power. Hmm, but I guess you wouldn't know. <laughs> but I guess you wouldn't know that it's without power. Or it had been without power for three days. I'm sorry, I gave away too much. See, that is a weakness of mine when I'm doing games, is I... I, uh, I want to give away too much information. I want to make the reader, or excuse me, the player, um, or my players, more engaged with the story. I want them to know how much backstory it has. Um, for some reason, that's important to me. So I gave away a little bit too much information. Yeah, I guess if you see any... I love this picture. If you see any pictures that you like... Gosh try to identify them as much as you can. I could tell a story about those ones. Anyway. Yeah, it's definitely broadcasting this stuff, but just the same. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I hope that wasn't grossly loud. Grr. Okay, where was I? Let's get back into the story. I'm curious to see what, what might happen, whether I can think of something while we're playing it. So again, this is completely 
off the top of my head as hard as that is so please do not judge me too harshly for uh, failing somehow the ship is directly ahead and it is floating uh, drifting what do you want to do? Yes, that's the target. That's what you were sent here to find. Am I sure? Oh. <laughs> okay, communications. Sure. No need to make a roll. It's a really easy action. You send a wide band ping designed to get the most the highest chances of, of a response, no matter what frequency the the people are on. There's no response. No response. Do you want to try it again? Okay, no, yeah, you can try to boost the power. Sure. Yeah, maybe they're trying to respond, but they're their power is so weak that they that they can't, or the signal's not strong enough. Sure, you can boost your receiver power. Um, that's going to mean mean a couple of changes in mechanics, and you're going to have to have somebody program the uh, make the the necessary changes to the programming so you can receive more information. Okay, cool. Um, okay, so first let's make your mechanics roll. Oh, I see we didn't set up our dice yet. I hope you can hear this. That is just the best sound in the world, the dice. So first, your mechanics roll. Okay, that's a success. So it takes you about 20 minutes to make the, the changes um, to the system that'll allow you to, to boost power. And who's doing the computer roll while, uh, while this is going on? Or is it going to be one person? Because that's going to take a while. Okay, you can do the roll. That's cool. Okay, go for it. And one fell off the table. You can roll that one again. Nice roll. Okay, you boost the power. Or, excuse me, you make the necessary changes to the program. Um, in fact, you do so good that um, it works even more efficiently than you thought it would have than you thought it was going to. <clears throat> when you tell everybody um, how, how well you succeeded, are you going to be modest about it, or are you going to be really brash? Yeah? Okay. So, let's hear it. I want to hear, hear what you have to say. Oh, come on. Okay. Um, so, yeah, you just show off, and it's... Uh, yeah, you show off about your powers. You make it make it sound like you know you're this fabulous programmer. Now that's going to affect how everybody else sees you on a scale. Well, maybe anyway. That's what I'd like to see. I want to see the players have knowledge of whether they like the guy or whether they can't stand him but respect him. Or you know, I'd like to see that that level of detail. But I suppose that's a little bit too much to ask sometimes. So, that's cool. 